was like, oh yes, I don't remember that. I was exactly. so shocked. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> but since then, you didn't stop. In how many Eurovision pre parties did you sing already? London, Amsterdam, Madrid, of course. Ma and, and Israel. Four. Yes. <laughs> how are the, the Eurovision <laughs> fans receiving your song? Do they like the song? Yes, they are. They it's are. crazy because we have fans in Israel, in Amsterdam, in uh, Portugal, in Portugal. <laughs> yeah, of course. It's of course. very strange. Strange, it's yes. yes, okay, but it's it's beautiful, it's amazing. You were not expecting this at all. Oh my god, it's such happiness! Oh, I hate happy people. No, I don't, I really like you. So, you have a very, very big responsibility here because you are representing Spain, but you also have to defend Operation Triunfo reputation. Yeah, because the three times. Ah, man. Spanish entry was picked in, op in Operación Triunfo, Rosa, Vez y Ramón. Yeah. Uh, Spain. Edurnes, right? Uh, yeah, no, but uh, with the show. Yeah. With the show, it was yeah. just three times, I yeah. think. The song finished in the top ten. Do you think about that a lot, or not at all? I, I don't understand you. Que siempre que la música ha sido elegida en Operación Triunfo, que ha terminado en, en top ten. Ah. En 2002, ¿qué es? Mi castellano no es muy bueno, perdón. My Spanish, my English is not that good as well. My Spanish is bad too. Yes, no, no. So, come on, do you think it's a responsibility? Yeah, of course. We are representing Spain, but also we are representing Operación Triunfo and there was uh, very good songs in the in the um, um, in the show. In the show, yeah. And so we are representing all of our uh, friends in Operation Triunfo. So it's a responsibility, of course. Spain already won twice. Must be early, Yes. Yeah. But. We have already 57 Spanish songs in Eurovision, with yours 58, if I'm not mistaken. From all the Spanish songs in Eurovision Song Contest, what's your favorite? My favorite, I love uh, Un Mundo Nuevo from Karina. Oh. Can you sing a little bit for that? I don't know. Why, well, you're, you're shy. No, como era? Al fin del camino en ti llevarás me invento un poco la letra, pero la plena ilusión de vivir. Olvida el pasado, pues no volverá. Muy bueno, muy bueno. Ana, I actually watched you performing, watched you performing a Marta de Torres from Salvador Sobral, and I remember that class you had when you were. Again, listening to the music, and you cried and you cried a lot. Is that music so? That song so special for you? Yeah, uh, months ago, um, before El Prezi Triunfo, I was in a in a bad moment in a bad moment in my life, and oh god, and I was with Anshidi. Is 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 the, is the word? I was with Anshidi, <laughs> and yeah, and and. This song, Amar Pelos Dois of, of Salvador Sobral, it means a lot to me because, to me because, uh, uh, gives me a lot of love and, and gives me, um, uh, you know, um, mucho soporte, mucho, very good support and and I'm in love with Salvador and with uh, Luisa Sobral with the uh, with. Uh, um, her songs and yeah, did it means a lot to me. Did you meet them already? No. Oh, you have to. Only, only Luisa. Only Luisa and Operación Triunfo. Yes. So we are going. We are going to introduce you Salvador Sobral. Please, promise. please. I prom. I really promise you. We were uh, we were uh, studying in the same school in Barcelona with Salvador in El Taller de Musics. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Wait, wait, wait. So I will introduce you to Salvador, but you have to sing a little bit from Amar de Luz Dois for us. It's like a trade. I introduce you to Salvador and you sing a little bit for us. For me it's a pleasure. <laughs> Three, two, one. 
si un día alguien pregunta por mí, dices que viví para te amar antes de ti, só existí cansado sin nada para dar. Meu bem, oh, das minhas expressas, peço que regresses, que me voltes a querer. Eu sei que não se ama sozinho, talvez devagarinho possas voltar a aprender. Uh, hi, I'm Alvaro from Destination Eurovision. Hola. Uh, hola, yo soy portugués. Yo, si quieres que hable, haga la pregunta en castellano, puedo intentar. But then you have to translate. Don't worry, man. <laughs> okay. My my question is: uh, every time you rehearse, you have to to trying to reconnect with your feeling you feel from for each other. How do you do that? Is uh, difficult emotionally for you? Uh, like uh, reconnecting every time with the feeling you have for each other. Thank you. you. Mean every every time we sing the song. Yes. I think every time it is different because it depends yeah. on the situation, on the people, <coughs> on the feeling that we we have this moment. Yeah. There's no secret when you're angry, huh? <laughs> Bad thing, man. Yes, it's <laughs> tu canción. No, no, it's no. No, it's it's a joke. But yeah, you have to reconnect with the first time that you sing the song, and it's it's a it's a good thing for me because you you have to think about the first moment, and you have to connect with your past and with your feelings in the past, and it's it's a good it's a good um, thing. Thank you. Thank you. Next question. <laughs> yes. Es un muy buen ejercicio. Hola, eh, Hola. la haré en español para que la pienses y mientras la traduzco me respondes. ¿Ok? Vale, perfecto. Ok. So, mi pregunta es: eh, como habían dicho, conectan con algo y han estado en diferentes pre-parties. Al momento de cantar o estar en ese escenario, cada uno distinto, ¿con qué se quedan de cada una de esas fiestas? ¿En qué momento se quedan de.? ¿Qué momento vivido de cada una de esas fiestas se llevan con ustedes? So you've been performing in different uh, parties, probably the same song, and you live different experiences. Which moment or feeling you keep close to your heart from the different uh, performances that you have done? For me, for me, uh, with the feedback of the crowd, it's very important uh, because it's uh, the feedback is the um, the, uh, the test of of uh, our our feel our yeah our our intention our feel in the song yeah yes me too <laughs> <laughs> yes 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 please yes thank you hi Alistair Birch from, hi there from Eurofile I have a question for Alfred. Um, I read somewhere you started singing in bars at a young age. Yeah. So what did you learn about life as a 14-year-old in bars? Thank you very much for the question. It's very interesting because uh, I think I think that with this uh, uh, preparation, with this preparation, you you learn a lot and and you have um, you have. Uh, Things. Uh, okay. Sorry. One moment, because I have to. I have to check it. That gives you a very high preparation. And give you so many things that if you have not that, 
you have not got that experience. Probably he could not be here. When you, when, when you, uh, when I was a young boy with uh, 13 or 14 years, uh, I was uh, playing with my loop pedal and with my guitar and with my trombone, and I was playing in the worst, and uh, uh, the worst venues in, in 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 my city in Barcelona, and and when you uh, see all these things. Um, you you are more prepared in in this world, and I think it's it's basic to to do, uh, to to work in this in this industry in in this job. Yeah. Thank you. Sorry. Next, Next question. You, please. lovely lady. Yes, it's you. How are you? Nice to have you here. Hello, Madeleine Popova, EurovisionBulgaria.com. Hola. Hola. Chupus. You met at Operación Triunfo. Could each of you tell us what is the first thing that you like it in the other one? Uh, nothing. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I remember, no, no, no. I remember that the first day I saw him, that he was with a trombone, it was in, in the castings of, of the program. And I... How do you say? Me llamo la atención. Yes, he, give, he gives my attention. So you poor trombone. boy. Yes, and, yes, and I, I, I think, I thought that, oh, what, what are he going to do? But then I saw him and I like it. And I... T I ¿Cómo se dice? Lo, se lo dije a mi familia, en plan, les hablé de él. She talked to her family. Yes, I talked with my... Yes, yes. And we... Okay. I remember that. Yeah. And you? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, the trombone too, the trombone too. No. Uh, it was... Uh, she said to me that uh, she... Um, She liked very much a singer, Judith Nederman, and, and we conocíamos esa cantante. Yes, we. Do you know about that singer? It's very difficult to explain. Yes, she, she's a, a, a singer from Catalonia, from Barcelona, and she she stud, no, she studied with with him. With her, yeah. Yes. Yes, and, and, and then we, start, we started to talk with, with yes, yes, <laughs> and, and now... It's a very difficult here. story to explain in English. Yes, sorry. So last question, oh my god, what am I going to do? You three, what am I going to do? You decide. It's a quick one. It's a quick one, so I will try to do two of them. JP, go. Oh, they're going to hate me. It's JT from Radio International. Uh, I've seen you in Spain, you're a national hero, so it's amazing. On the show, thank you are radiating a lot of love. Oh, thank so, you. we thought of a, of, of a good question coming on. And there's a, a Eurovision record that stood since 1957, set by Berthe and Gustav from Denmark. And we were wondering if you are going to take, or to try and break that record. And being the longest on screen kiss at Eurovision, beating 11. Seconds. Would you kiss on the final? <laughs> That's true. More than 11 seconds. Ah. <laughs> Depends on, on, on the moment. Yes, in the moment, if. if yeah. oh, okay, no, but. Don't feel pressure. Yes, okay, yes, feel... yes. I think this, this thing. These things, it's a natural uh, thing, you know, yes. it depends on the moment. How do you say? Estas cosas no hay que planearlas. You don't have yes. to plan it. Yes. Yeah, it depends it. on the moment. You go, Sebastian Ganchi, you and don't kill me, please. Don't shout at me. Hello. Hola, Hermaya. Sebastian from Um 
performing on the Eurovision stage is very nerve-wracking. What do you tell each other before you go on stage? Hmm. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> no, but, but yes. No, hombre. <laughs> no, we are very concentrated, but about uh, we we talk we talk thoughts. Yes, like that, like. I don't like yes, this. We chat. Yeah, before the, the going to like, stage. No. Don't touch. No. no. We are concentrating. Yes, yes. No, but. But we, yes, we talk. Uh, yes, it depends yes. On, on ways, on the moment. So really, Thank last you. question. Don't, don't, Thank don't you. be upset with me. Uh, we just passed the time. Hi, I'm Farouk from Cocorizo Magazine in Paris. Buenos dias. Hola. Uh, hola. Um, you are singing a very romantic song. And for you, for each of you, what is the most romantic Spanish song? And maybe you can sing it a little bit. Romántica, ¿no? La canción, la que en España. Algo pequeñito. Algo chiquitito. ¿Es romántica? Yo qué sé. Ah, vaya. Pero puede ser. Sí. Cosas simples que ahora no me das. It's romantic, ¿no? Yes. Tu canción. Tu canción. Eh, what? What? Tu canción. I don't know this one. No. no. A ver, ¿y cuál más? No, es que I want to say. Dile que la quiero. David Cibera. Sí, oh. But um, yes. Eh, si no, ¿cuál? Pastora Soler. Yes. Quédate bien conmigo. La Nerea, our, our, our friend in Operación Triunfo, sing that song. Very good. If you want to, you, you, you can sing now. No, no. no. <laughs> you don't have to. No, we don't You're know afraid, how to sing. You're very afraid. afraid. Yes, no, but... Um, mm, I don't know. It, uh, they are, they are, there are a lot of songs, a, a lot of romantic songs. You don't have songs. to. You don't, you don't want to choose one. Yes, yeah, yes. Thank you very much. Thank you. Very, 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 very good to be here. Hazle el llamado España, España.